Now, that's the sound so many have missed. EastEnders, though, returns to our screens on Monday after nearly three months off air. We'll finally see what's in store for Martin and Ruby. Oh, well, James Vine plays Martin Fowler joins me now. James, it's so lovely to see you. How are you doing? Yeah, I'm really well, thank you. Yeah, I don't think we've ever met before, Lorraine. So to, to meet on, online is a, I know. an unusual thing. One day you will be back in here one day soon, I hope, I hope. So Wrong back course. on air, back on air, you must be so relieved. Oh, relieved, excited. Um, we're all just um, so happy to be back doing what we love. Um, and hopefully the audience will, will appreciate what sort of hard work the whole team's done. Sure. Now, in a practical sense, how is it all working? Because, I mean, obviously social distancing has to be observed and that's difficult when people are having, like, intimate scenes or arguing and, you know, it's, it's, how do they make it work? Yeah, absolutely. So, yeah, of course, uh, and we, we are really strict with, um, with the social distancing. So uh, when you watch the scenes, at no point is anybody, you know, not just cast but, but crew, two metres, um, any, any closer than two metres. So for things like kissing, which obviously Ru um, Lu Lu Louisa and I have had to do, it, um, it can be quite tricky. But thank thanks to the, the amazing team, we've got EastEnders, we've got some camera magic going on. Ah, that's incredible. You know, We're seeing that now, that you guys know, are yeah. so far apart, but because of the angle and the, the clever that's trickery, that. It makes it look like you're really close together. That is, and, and the funny thing with that that scene that, that you're just watching there, that that was, I mean, obviously EastEnders have had time to prepare for coming back and trying to trying to film in lockdown with the, the two meters. Um, but there are certain things, obviously, no one's ever done it before, so there are things that we're learning on on the job. And that that in particular was the director and, and the lead cameraman kind of figuring out that this could work. Um, so you can see, obviously, Louise is smiling like there, and I'm we're not sure what's going on. We're just looking at each other from a distance. And um, yeah, of course it works on the camera. So that was one of those things that just happened spur of the moment and um, yeah, it worked really well. No, it's so interesting. And what, what is interesting as well is we're not picking up where we left off. Three months in real time have gone by. So we are in the situation where Martin and Ruby are together. Um, yeah. You know, the, and, and we've got to kind of fill in the gaps. I guess that's going to happen as the, as the days unfold. Yeah, exactly. So we've not, we're not just going to pick up exactly where we left off. All the characters have been living like everybody else in these two months in lockdown. Um, relationships have formed, relationships have broke down, people have, um, you know, have changed during um, in lockdown. So that's, that's a little journey that the audience will kind of learn as the, as the, um, as the show restarts on Monday. Um, and it's really interesting, like something like obviously Martin and Ruby, who the audience I don't think even saw together. There was a bit of flirtation. Um, and now they're in a full-blown kind of relationship where they're all loved up, and um, and yes, yeah, it's, it's, it's got a, a bit of a, a bit of a journey to go on when it comes you back. Betcha. Because apparently Stacey is all set to come back. We don't want to give too much away, but shall we just say yeah. fasten your seatbelts? I think is what we can say. Yeah, lace yes. back. And um, I, it's funny because when, before I got the script, I didn't know how it was going to play out. I didn't know what her character was going to feel, but uh, I think the way that they've taken it is, is really exciting. And mm. there's some like massive scenes between the three of us um, and particularly between Lacey and Louisa. So yeah, um, look out. Absolutely. You all must miss each other so much though, because it is like your second family. Um, and I know you yeah, can be in yeah. touch on Zoom and everything, and that's great, but there's nothing like actually being there. No, and, and you could tell on the first day back, everyone was just bouncing around and, um, like just wanting to, you know, hug each other. Obviously, we can't, but it, it was it was just so lovely to to see everyone. And, and our first day back, a lot of the cast were in, albeit, you know, at, at two meters. Um, and so yeah, it was it was it was a really really you know fantastic day. And and it's just got got better and better. So. Now, look, everyone's talking Strictly right now, and I know Maisie, one of your co-stars, Maisie, um, who plays Tiffany, of course, she's signed for Strictly Come Dancing. Are you tempted, James? Is it something Am you I? would ever think about? Well, it's funny, because while, while we were just waiting to go on there, obviously, you've been teasing who's going to go on Strictly, and I just got a text from my mum going, I thought you were going on Strictly! <laughs> That's <laughs> brilliant! Like, I know, yeah, I'm just, like, just as we about to go out there. So, Hi, Mum, and um, she's watching. And um, yeah, no, I'm not going on Strictly this year. Would I consider it? Yeah, definitely. You know, um, obviously, a really uh, close friend of mine, Dave, went on it a couple of years ago. Yeah. He had a great time, um, and he said something for me to think about. Unfortunately, I'm not quite as fit as David. I've got uh, rickety old knees, um, so I perhaps have to uh, look into that. 
Um, Maybe one yeah, day. No, I mean, it looks great fun, and uh, good. Uh, you know, if, good luck to Maisie, and, and uh, she's she's amazing. Of course, she's sure. going to go on Strictly. She's uh, she's amazing. So yeah, it's great. just it's just a rumor at the moment, but it's kind of oh, looking is it? as oh, it? Well, I, I it's kind of looking I'm, like it's going to happen. I think it's right, kind of looking well, like I hope, that. I hope it does. No, look, she'll win it. Yeah, I think she'd be great. Now, as we are talking, your boys are getting ready to go back to school, aren't they? How are you yeah, feeling yeah. about that? Uh, yeah, there they are. Yeah, so my eldest, he's gone back for a full day today. Um, Louis, who's my who's charging around, he um, he's he's going in this afternoon. So you know, considering that they've been homeschooled by me and Victoria for the last few months, I think they can't wait to, to get away from us. Oh, here he is. <laughs> Want to come and say hello? Aww. He's been wanting to say hi. Lorraine. Hello, gorgeous. Are you looking forward to going back to school? Yeah. So yeah, he 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 can't wait. He, who's a better teacher? I'm all in now. Um, he's a better teacher. Um, me or, or Mrs. Chiswell? Me, I think's the answer. And yeah. then little Hugo. So this is what it's been like, Rain. <laughs> the three months. Add another one. And uh, yeah, Aww. you can see why I'm losing my hair, can't you? They're absolutely gorgeous. What beautiful, beautiful sons you have. Oh, they're, they're great. They really are. Thanks. And it's, Sorry, it's, I let them, I let them charge yeah. around now. They're watching but it's Peppa so Pig nice. and all sorts. That's been one um, thing. Having time to spend with the family has been great, hasn't it? Do you know what? My, Victoria and I talk about it all the time. We'll never get that again. You know, hopefully we'll never get that again. So, and we've had, uh, fortunately, a really lovely time with the kids. Um, yes, it's been hard, and I, I cannot praise the teachers <laughs> enough around the world that, that, that deal with what they have to deal with. Um, and so I think today has been quite an emotional day. Obviously, you saying goodbye to Edward after well, pretty much six months um, with having him at home. Um, but obviously, it's for the it's for the best. Um, so uh, also, it's nice to get my first hot cup of coffee. Indeed, um, <coughs> all parents will all parents will relate to that. Thank you so much for talking to us, James. Great to see you. Thank you. And EastEnders, as we said, back on Monday, 5 past 8 on BBC One. Don't forget, you can watch full episodes of Lorraine on the ITV Hub and all the best clips, compilations and playlists right here on our channel. Just subscribe now and you'll never miss an upload. Click here to watch another video similar to this one or click here to head to our channel's homepage to explore all of our exciting videos.